Hello, previously I posted a video on the channel about reducing color variability for warm and cold colors. In this video, I will show you how to increase color variability in the photo. I have such a shot from a drone. It is beautiful from an artistic point of view, but it's hard to see the details of the landscape on it, because everything is red. Let's fix it. The predominant colors are warm, so white balance needs to be reduced to increase color variability in this picture. The magenta color can be reduced with tint slider. Here's the result. As you can see, the lower white balance, the higher variability of warm colors. I have significantly lowered white balance, so some of the red hues have turned purple. I'm going to fix them with color grid. I will shift purple colors towards the red ones. If you want to further increase variability, you need to increase image saturation. Now I'm going to increase saturation in the shadows and decrease it in the highlights. And that's what happened. Warm areas on the image suit me. But what happened to the cold colors? There are a few of them, but they are here. Let's see this fragment of this photograph closer. Most likely, the car is painted in metallic gray. That is, it cannot be so blue. Cold shades became even bluer when I lowered white balance. So I will reduce the saturation of cold colors with the help of color grid. And that's what happened. Let's look at the original. Comparing to the result, it looks so red that it seems like one solid color fill. Compare it with the results. I'll enlarge some fragment. Here's before. Here is after. Do you see how many details appeared in the photo after increasing variability? It feels like I have sharpened the image, although I only worked with color. Now you know how to increase color variability in case you need to. That's all. I hope this video was useful. Bye everyone.